Hi everyone, welcome back to Code Step by Step. My name is Anil. In this part of Node.js, we will talk about REPL. So some guys just think that this is a advanced uh, feature of Node.js. No, this is very basic and simple feature of Node.js. Actually, very useful also, right? I will tell you how. But uh, let's start with the points of this video. First of all, I will tell you what is REPL, example of REPL, and interview questions. So it stands for read. Eval, eval means evaluation or evaluate you can say that print and loop so REPL is basically a command line tool for run the node.js or javascript code how it can run the both programming language code node.js and uh, javascript see node.js basically is not a programming language this is a runtime environment which basically use javascript so we can say that it can run the code of node.js as well as javascript right so how we can use it you just need to just simply go to the command line and you can simply put here node and enter now you are inside the wrapper right what it actually do here you can write any kind of node.js or javascript code it will give you the result so when you want to just run a simple script or simple code then you don't need to create a new file and run it on the browser or or uh, run it with the node.js environment you can just simply uh, open the command line just put here node and you can just start with your uh, code right i can show you how if i'm just putting here 2 plus 2 it can just give the result 4 if i am just taking a normal variable let's say a equal to 10 semicolon b equal to 30 and uh, i am putting here a plus b now you can see that this is giving a result so here we can run our node.js code right when you want to just uh, make a small example or you want to just experiment something whenever you have to make a complete project you should not use this tool that time you have to create files and complete project structure right so now you may have a question that we can run only one line here not actually we can just use multiple lines also i can show you just create a function let's say my function name is test and now whenever i am just creating a function and entering it uh repl tool is smart enough to understand that uh, that developer need to write more code that's why it just uh, provide the sign of continue and we can just write our code here so let's say i am just making a console dot log and i am putting here this is a test function and after that i can just close this function like this and now after closing this bracket it again just gives a new command so uh, you it can actually give the arrow for new command so now i can just simply run here test function like this and we got the output here so with that way we can use the multiple line but there is a one more feature which is editor so when you don't want to just uh, write the code line like this let's say you want to you uh, make the multiple functions at the same time that how you can do that for that you can just simply use here dot editor feature this is basically a feature of REPL. don't think that this is a different feature and here we can just create a multiple functions let's say i am just simply cutting here making a function let's say test uh, let me just put here apple this is a different function name and uh, i can just make it console dot log apple is fruit right and now i can just close this function now you can see that again i can write some another another function so let's say i'm just putting here banana and i am just making console again like a banana function or something and i am just closing it now after completing your code just simply press here control d and now you can run your function so let's say i want to run here banana function and here you can see that this is working so with that way we can use the REPL to run your small code and small functions so that we can just uh, we don't need to create a new project and run it on the browser and all right so after that uh, there is some more command so whenever you will just put here help 
you will find some more cut like uh, how you can break the lines how you can just clear editor exit and all so we can use these things so let's say i just want to use the edit so just simply put here dot exit and i will be the outside from the uh, wrapper thank you so much for watching this video interview question so in this video we will discuss a little bit tricky interview question so here you can see that i have conched this value of 10 and if i am just printing here x plus plus so what should be the output here any error 11 10 or 9 thank you so much for watching this video and please don't forget to just give the answer of this interview question in the comment box